welcome back. Let's have some fun. I went to Michael's today and I picked up this, uh, this guy because I found this really cool picture on Google. It was a black pumpkin with like gems on it and I was like, I can do that. So that's what we're going to attempt here today. While I was there, I got a bunch of um, sparkly things. I genuinely, genuinely dislike glitter. So I don't know why I thought this would be a good idea. But here we are. We're going to do it. I put, ow. I put plastic on my floor to like protect it from uh, any glitter because I'm not about to like ruin my life over glitter. We are going to paint the uh, top little stem bit silver. Technically this color is called pure platinum, so. Is my brush too wet? I'm grabbing cotton balls. I don't have any paper towels. I hope you deeply enjoyed my last video because I never want to do it again. I am an acrylic painter. I like working with acrylics. Things that don't take, I don't know, seven days to dry. The painting just got done drying today. Oh, my eyes are burning. Got it covered. Wow, that water is so pretty. I don't know if you can see it. That is so pretty. Oh, hello? I don't quite know what I'm doing. So, like, I got these fun gems that I think I'm just gonna, like, glue on. And I got, like, glitter and I got confetti glitter, which, if you've seen my, uh, Peter and the Star Catcher behind the scenes, you know that this stuff and I have a very special, painful bond. I have to go sweep the stage. I have to sweep up the glitter. I don't get to feel emotion. I have to sweep up glitter. <laughs> Uh, uh. <laughs> I'm gonna like start sorting these and I'll come back once that's done and we're ready to like start gluing things on. So I just spent the last like, I don't know, 15 minutes organizing all these gems. It was a nightmare. Oop, that's still wet paint. Oh no. I just did it again. Ugh. Here's a fun fact for you. If you're using a... a, a, a if you're using like a Q-tip, dip like the back of the brush or something, dip it into a little bit of this glue, and you can use that to grab your gems. Boom. I have these kind of like a plastic things, but I'm gonna use these to kind of like move things around. Ooh, I'm starting to figure this out. Okay. things work out in my favor. This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do this the lazy man's way. If there's anything that I've noticed, it's that you guys really like tea. If you guys really want some tea, there you go. I don't celebrate Halloween. And I know I'm not the only person like out in the world that doesn't celebrate Halloween. But like, I just never have and Okay. This is like as spooky as this channel's gonna get, is this black pumpkin. Okay, well that looks pretty interesting. Maybe I'll do like foil on the bottom because I'm getting lazy already. Maybe we'll, I don't know, we'll do something. I love bad ideas. We're gonna unscrew this glitter, which might be a really bad mistake. This one has this little scoopy thing. So I'm just gonna take that scoopy thing and use it. Just scoop. I'm just kind of turning it on its side a little bit and just kind of lightly tapping it. Oh, it's pretty! Let me show it to dad. It's, it's gonna get glitter everywhere. Make sure that your parents are your biggest fan. I'm gonna put these little confetti pieces on the top now so it's gonna be like a mirror of it, you know? This feels like a really intense game of operation. 
I'm not quite sure how I feel about that. Like, my Grey's Anatomy knowledge really needs to come through right now. This is hard. It's on a round surface. Happy to see you live on this day. And then we'll do, um... Is my battery already dying? My battery's about to die. I'm gonna try to finish up this pumpkin. I didn't explain much of what I'm doing, but it's kind of like self-explanatory. I'll try to catch it before I start actually finish it, but I'm gonna go insane. <laughs> literally been like three or something hours and I have one more little section down here to go what I've been doing is I literally been just taking the glue and just kind of like slapping it on there like really thick and then I take this little uh, scrapey tool this little like rake and I've just been kind of using that to get like an even coat and then with the little scoopy side on the other, I've been going in with the loose, like really fine glitter and just kind of like tapping it over it. I like dip it in some glue and put it into the big chunky glitter and just kind of drag that around and wherever it sticks is wherever it goes. And then I take like the gems and I literally just stick them on, boom, and there it's done and then I just kind of smack it a couple times and then oh boy also if you couldn't tell I'm filming this on my iPhone camera because my batteries died while filming this again two weeks in a row on a roll anywho here's the mostly dry finished product covered in glitter and glue is on my shirt. I'm really disappointed about that because I actually really like this shirt. I hope you have a happy and safe Halloween. I'm sorry if this video wasn't up to par. There's a piece of glitter on it and it ruined my quality, whatever. But anyways, it's on my lips. Ah. Wishing you the best. I love you. Thank you for watching. I will see you in my next video. Happy spooky. Bye. Well, my camera died again. And this is my workplace. Um, this is like every crafter's worst nightmare. It just doesn't end. Yay me.